I thought we had to have one reference. It would be perverse not to. I knew it would be the Cheshire Cat because I think you'd be cheating the audience out of that, the pleasure of that, I think. And the way around that was not to do it as an illustration, but to make the illustration uh, three-dimensional. The characters within Alice are so wonderful. And there's so much charm locked within the mystery of the literature. But what's the story here? How are we really going to tell Alice's story? I mean, one of the things I'm very mindful of is that two hours is a long amount of music to construct, and there needs to be through lines, and there needs to be an awful lot of variety within that, but all within this strange, magical world that Lewis Carroll set up. My idea is that the moment the curtain goes off, I want the music to be completely, extraordinarily magical. So it's not scored for simply a normal orchestral setup. This Wonderland sound, this very specific, engaging, strange, fantastic sound world. 